<laughs> Hi guys, welcome to book two. My name is Brenna. Today, I will be doing a book talk on the book The Candy Makers. Just to start off by saying this book got me out of a little reading slump, which is why I appreciate it a lot. I rated this book on Goodreads 5 out of 5 stars. It was amazing. It was probably the best middle grade book that I've read. It's up there in my entire life. This book made me really, really hungry. Okay, so this book is about four kids named Logan, Daisy, Philip, and Miles. They get entered into a contest to make the next worldwide candy. They go into a factory called Life is Sweet. I think that's what it's called. And they pretty much just take a tour and they learn all about the factory and then they get to candy making. So yeah, there's adventure, there is mystery. At first I was like, uh, this is gonna be a retelling of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. But it is not like that at all. If anything, you can compare it to like Hoodwink, where it's like a span of time, but they take the different point of views of the people over that same span of time. And you learn something new about each person and you find out what they were doing throughout that whole day. All the kids had different motives for winning. I found myself rooting for all of them to win. By far, Daisy's point of view was my favorite. It definitely spiced up the story and took a twist and a turn. If I had to change one thing about this book, it would be their ages. I had kind of a hard time imagining them as 12 year old kids. Like I had the question, like why would you leave the next greatest candy of the world in the hands of a 12 year old kid? If anything, they should be like 15, 16, 17, because even in the story, they kind of talked like they were 15, 16, 17. I could ask that question, but then I came to terms with it and realized that this is just a fun book. It's not really meant to be criticized like that. Like it's supposed to be a fun read. You're not really supposed to think about it that much. And that's exactly what it was. I had a really fun time. The ending was perfect. This book gave me good vibes and that's all I have to say. Currently, I'm actually reading the second one. I didn't know there was a second one until yesterday. I went to Barnes and Noble. Have you guys read Candy Makers? If you have, comment down below how you liked it. Comment down below what you're currently reading. And until next time, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.